from Bakes for Bubbles and I wanted to share my December favorites and beginning of winter favorites with you guys. So December was a crazy month. We had all kinds of holiday events and we celebrated Christmas here at home with the girls. All those vlogs from Christmas are on my other vlog channel, Be Mommy with Style. So I'll link those down below if you want to check out our day in the life. So they're all over there. But I wanted to share my myself, me, mommy favorites with you guys. And I have a couple new ones. So we recently moved over the summer. We're finally all settled in. And one of the things that we did in our new location was we got a Costco membership. So Costco has definitely been one of my favorites. It's probably one of the most like random weird favorites that I have this month. But everything from bulk food items for the girls to take to school, to just household items, to food, just like treat things, to clothing, I have really enjoyed finding at Costco. It's like the most random thing ever. So this sweater that I'm wearing right now is actually from Costco, and I have this in another color as well. This is just like a really long tunic sweater. It's a knit, and the brand is Calvin Klein. So that's the thing, is like you can find like kind of like known brands, but stuff that you'd find like at Marshalls or TJ Maxx, and it's so comfortable. So it's just a really big knit tunic, and I don't know, I love it. It's so comfortable. So I have this one that I just got. It's like in a sparkly, like charcoal gray black, and then this is the first one that I got, which is in like a sparkly rose pink color, and I found those at Costco. They were $19.99, and I'm loving them. So also, I found a couple gift items for Christmas at Costco. Now, I don't know if this is available at all Costco's, but this one is a Michigan company, so it may just be local to us. This is Sanders Fine Chocolates, and this is the Sea Salt Caramels. They're amazing. So what I did for Christmas is I took one of these big canisters that I got at Costco for $9.99, and I divided it in about three or four parts, and I put them in little kind of... Uh, clear plastic bags and tied them off with a cute little bow and I gave them the people for a gift like just additionally to like a gift card or whatever else I was giving them. They turned out really cute but these things are amazing. One of our babysitters literally texted me after she got home after I'd given them to her. It was like those caramels. They're amazing. Where are they from? So I found these at our Costco. If you're in Michigan, most of the Michigan Costco's have these. I'm not sure about other areas but they're seriously addictive. So I gave away all the ones that we had, so I went and got one little naughty one that we're keeping here at the house, but they're so amazing. Like, you can't keep them on hand because they're that good. So bag-wise, I think we already thoroughly covered in other videos what my favorite bag was, but just to mention it and touch on it, I have been using my Alma PM, and I love my little puff. This was definitely a favorite for the month. This is from Nordstrom. It's the halogen brand. They have a couple different colors available, and I love the silver hardware on it in particular. So this bag's working out really well, and I have a video dedicated just talking about how this ended up working out for me. But I've been using this one, and then like when I go to the gym and just for like more casual moments, I've been using my, as always, Rebecca Minkoff Morning After Clutch in the charcoal gray. So those have been really working out for me, and obviously I've been very into like the grays and the blacks recently, so that has been what I have been liking. Also, I got my super cute polar bear case. This is from Kate Spade. I also ordered this from Nordstrom. This um, is just like my favorite. I'm going to use it all winter long. I will say I've already lost a rhinestone. Um, so these rhinestones apparently are going to pop out pretty easily, but I don't even care because it's that cute. So I got this little case at Nordstrom. I believe it was about $45 or something, but this is going to be my winter phone case, and I was so excited when I found it because I love polar bears. Also, this past month, I've had a couple people ask on videos, and I let them know there, but my lip color that I've been wearing, I absolutely love it, and I've been wearing it a ton. So it's the one I've had in recent videos as well. And what it is, you can see I'm actually almost out of it. I need to order another one. This is Makeup Forever. This is one I've had for a while. Number 10, which I believe the name is Cool Pink. It's from the Rouge Intense lipstick line, and it's a really, really pretty pink. I love wearing this alone. In fact, I wear this a lot in the summer. I checked on Sephora to replenish this one and get another one for my purse, and Sephora was out, but it is available on MakeupForever.com right now, so I'm going to be ordering a couple more of those. But what I've been doing to kind of change the color for winter is I got this in a little bag that I got from Sephora, like a, got like a free like party bag or something that had a bunch of deluxe samples, and this is Bubbly Grenadine. And this is a really great pink color that looks kind of scary when you, it looks very neon, 
whenever you just put it on so you can see it looks very bright. But then what I found is when I layered these two over one another, it just gave such a beautiful kind of fuchsia pink berry color and I'm loving that for winter. So that is what is on my lips is these two combined. I love this combination. I'm going to be buying a full size one of these and throwing this in my purse and then grabbing a couple more of these. But that is the lip combination that is working for me. So you can see how it kind of changed ever so slightly when I layer the two over one another. But that is the lip combination that I've been wearing in all my recent videos. Another makeup favorite that I think I've mentioned in past videos is this Becca blush. This is the Beach Tint and Shimmer Souffle in the Raspberry Opal color. I really love this. This is again another berry pink color and it's really been working out great. I've been wearing it in the fall, I've been wearing it in the winter and it just gives a nice subtle color and it's very long lasting. So I'm really liking these Beach Tints. I'm definitely going to be getting some more of these but right now this Raspberry Opal one is the one that I'm wearing a ton. Also, another fun thing that I found in December was this Alex and Ani polishing cloth. So I got this at the Alex and Ani store. It was only six bucks. And it's a little polishing cloth that has like a white interior. So I'm going to be doing an Alex and Ani bracelet collection. I know that a couple people had requested that on both channels, and I'll put that over here. But what happens with these, if you wear them a lot, is they start to get slightly tarnished, if you can kind of see there on this Mickey one that I have, which is from the Disney line. And so I found this polishing cloth that was only 6 bucks, and I thought, you know what, I'll just give it a try. It's not that expensive. I don't know you know, how well it's going to work. But I actually found that it works really, really well. So all you have to do is rub it back and forth in between the two white parts. It's the white ones are the cleaning ones, and then the outer is this kind of like protective barrier. And you have to kind of work on it so you can tell that it's not like 100% me just sitting here in this video. But you can tell already it's made a difference. So it takes a little bit of work. You have to kind of sit there with them. But this might be something you could do while you're sitting there watching TV and it kind of helps take some of the tarnish off and um, brightens them up for sure. So I think for six bucks, you can also get this on alexandani.com. I definitely think this is worth it and I'm going to go ahead and grab a couple the next time I'm in the store just in case like for some reason they stop carrying them or something or to give as gifts. I know my daughter's teacher wears these bracelets so um, I think it makes a great little gift and they it does work so I'll be talking more about my Alex and Ani collection coming up soon um, but this they have been a favorite I'm always wearing them lately um, but this little cloth has been a favorite this past month and last but not least this cute little home decor item that I found in the Target dollar spot and this is just something that just recently got put out right at the end of December, beginning of January. So it might just be coming soon to your store. So mercury glass is always a favorite of mine. I have mercury glass all over my house and I love the effects of it, especially if you put a candle in there. But I really like, they call this a voltive candle holder and this is $3. I'm actually planning, I think I'm getting a couple of them. I thought that these would be super cute as makeup brush holders to use as a candle holder. You could get the LED candles from Hobby Lobby and stick it down inside or you could do a plethora of things if you're into art holding colored pencils and all sorts of things. that is all of my favorites for the month of December hopefully you guys had a wonderful holiday season and I will see you in a video coming up very soon thanks for watching bye